Hello my guys, I'm Grimkey here, and I decided to tackle a uh, license tile. I don't know, I, I mentioned I would do license tiles, but I'm going to subject to this one because I just couldn't help myself. So, the stomach is called Hand Rubber Beyond. Before I, well, mention about, like, mention of it, the comic does contain, like, material that's not suitable for younger children. Print of discretion is advice. So what they so what got DC Comics to make the idea to turn however a license they had into a rather adult stuff. So So here's how it is. A certain company actually put their more kid friendly characters in and put it in a horror setting. And boy that one was risque. So So these sounds like over of Hammer Barrel, which was announced in 2016 with Scooby Doo Apocalypse, which said Scooby Doo in the Apocalypse, where the monsters are real, and Chucky looks like a millennial. The other stuff has been a mixed bag. Like, a mixed bag of being successful or non successful. So, so they decided, let's give the others realistic value images. And make them get towards the audience. So, so let's get on to it. The Flintstones, which put your Stone Age family in still in their Stone Age selves, but but dealing with modern day problems, where well, it puts them in likely conflicts, which aliens, aliens shooting other cavemen, and you have to do is coping mechanism. Yes, so this comic is a yabba dabba doozy. Yep. Yeah. Now the Flintstones weren't really geared towards kids anyway, as as it aired in prime time, which which is where your usual adult animation came from. So yes, Scooby Doo is so I I mean so yes, Flintstones is the first adult animated show. At least at least the first prime time show. Which led to the other adultness. And. And then there's the Jetsons. But the Jetsons in Black Mirror. And wow. You guys don't even need to buy. Go online and look at the. Go online and. And, and Google Hammer Bear Beyond. And look, and look at the Jetsons comic cover, and look at, look at Rosie's, look at the version of what they did for Rosie. That looks cool to me. To me, I consider that cool. That looks pretty cool. And Black Mirror. I don't know what Black Mirror is. If you guys watch Black Mirror, leave a comment down below to tell me what, so what is the with Black Mirror? <sighs> yeah. And then there's Wacky Racing, but the Wacky Racing characters in Mad Max. Yeah, uh, they could do like Fast and the Furious or like Death Race, but but you do you, DC. So so then there's also one well, with a uh, cat and a dog, which I don't know what the name is because I couldn't find it online. Yes. Online. So. So, what is the next one? Uh, well, next up we got here is is Future Quest, which sets the which sets here, Johnny Quest, which I've had actually seen some episodes of it as some reruns of it as a child. Uh, on Boomerang's more action block. Yeah. Yeah, so... And also they had, like, some other, like, Amber Bear characters, like... Like, you might know, too, because of their more adults from Smith series. These two are... Harvey Birdman and Space Ghost! Also the others. Also the other... Also, there's also a Hong Kong Fooey one, but I don't know if that is... A hammer beyond beyond tile. 
But I just wanted to so, uh, uh. Last one up is Zagabus, a where, where he's portrayed as a gay playwright playwright I mean playwright closeted it in the nineteen fifties. Yes. I mean closeted it gay playwright in the nineteen fifties. Yes. Now now today's society might be acceptable of gays, but it is kinda of nice seeing how gay marriages was like in the fifties. A nice time of of rock and roll and and Elvis' hips. Yes. There's also a top cat like crossover with Batman, but I don't consider that a time for But we're gonna do some I would love to see I don't know, like let's see. Hmm. I would love to see Super Friends and also Top Cat, because I just like that cat. I just like cats. Yeah. So that's all for now. Don't forget to slash the like button, kill comment, and bye bye!